Hey guys, Orvis25 here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to go ahead and set up your Starship Troopers game to work on Windows 10. This also might work on Windows 8.1 and Windows 7, but I cannot guarantee it, so take it with a grain of salt if you're going to follow these directions. Um, so the first thing that you're going to need to do is we're going to have to go ahead and go into my documents and go ahead and open up the Empire Interactive folder, go into the Starship Troopers folder, and go into the Settings folder. We're going to go ahead and open up the global settings file with a like notepad reader. And this is where we're going to change our resolution because the in-game resolution one only goes so high. So I'm going to go ahead and change this to 1920 by 1080 because that's my monitor resolution. Then we're going to go ahead and scroll down to the bottom here to the other section. And we're going to go ahead and change glow from 1 to 0. Whoops, I mistake there so change that to zero there we go change glow trail to zero change distort to zero and go ahead and change post processing to zero now that all those are set go ahead and go to file and save it and that's it for that we can go ahead and close that out and then we're going to go ahead and take a look at the actual in-game settings because there's some things that we need to change there Okay, so now that we're actually in the game, we're going to go ahead and go to Options, Graphics. And you'll notice that the video mode says this resolution, but it's really not. It's into whatever resolution you set previously. Um, now, you're going to go ahead and set the terrain shadows to none. And then down here for shader quality, if I can find it. There we go, shader quality, past it. Go ahead and set that to low. But everything else you can max out. So as you can see, I have soft shadows to on, adaptive to best, um, dynamic to high, texture to high, and everything else you know set to whatever. But you have to make sure that your terrain shadows is off and that your shadow quality is set to low. And that's it for the in-game settings. The last thing we're going to do is I'm going to show you how to fix the last level bug where um, if you play all the way to the end of the game, uh, when you try to load the last mission, it'll crash, so I'm going to show you how to fix that right now. Okay, so now that we're back on the desktop, what you're going to want to do is go down to your uh, icon on your desktop for the game. Go ahead and right-click it and go to Open File Location. Once you're in that location, what we're going to go ahead and do is go inside this ST folder right here. And these are going to be all the levels um, in the game. Now you're going to go ahead and find the level right here called level underscore brain bug. And we're going to change its naming. We're going to go ahead and the first B is capital, but the second B is not capital. We're going to change that and make the second B in the name to a capital B. So it still says brain bug, but it's with a capital B um, in both brain and bug. Go ahead and click off it so that it saves. So now it says brain bug with two capital Bs. And that's pretty much it. That's all you got to do to fix the last level bug. And now your game should run just fine. So anyway, guys, that's all you got to do to get Starship Troopers to work on Windows 10 um, the best that it can. There'll still be a few bugs, like when you use scopes and stuff in the game, you'll get a black screen. Uh, there's been no fix for that found yet. Uh, I've scoured the internet. Um, it's just a limitation of the game being really old and modern hardware uh, being too advanced for the game engine. And uh, just, you know, poor programming on part of the... Uh, developers so uh, I can't help you with that so if you ask I'm not really going to reply to those but um, oh one more quick thing um, if you guys want I will have a typed out version of the directions in the description so go ahead and check the description if you want a typed out version instead of listening to my entire video or the visual aid anyway guys have a good day thanks for watching my video guys I really hope you enjoyed it if you want to find my latest videos, you can go ahead and click right here. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And if you'd like to know where you can get the best deals on games and get them for up to 75% off, go ahead and click the link in the description. And don't forget to follow me on Twitter to keep up to date. I hope you all have a good rest of your day.